So, after we gave Bob a lovely brain transplant, by the way, he looked better than ever once he recovered, uh, then uh, he accidentally um, he accidentally walked into a door and uh, both of his eyes just stopped working. So, I've been tasked with the very serious job of putting his eyes back in. Now, I know what you're thinking. Didn't you give him eyes not that long ago? And yes, yes I did. But this time, I haven't got a surgery anymore because they took my goddamn surgery away. Because they said I wasn't good enough. They told me that you can't operate on teeth, so therefore you're not good enough for a surgery anymore. You're not going. Instead, we're going to send you in an ambulance. But I've been handing out resumes. I'm trying to get a new job somewhere. But first, let's, uh, let's go give our patient Bob some eyes so he can see the world again. You know? Bob, I heard you walked into a door frame. Very, 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 very stupid of you, might I ask. Might I add. Um... Now, Bob, yet again, you shouldn't be scared. Now, I caught Bob while he was at work this time. I'll be honest, okay? And he walked into a door frame because I pushed his head into a door frame. But this time, I'm going to give him some new eyes so that he can see. Because, well, Bob is some sort of space engineer or something like that, okay? I don't exactly know, but... He's a space engineer. Can you tell by the safety goggles? Look, they're very good. They're made of glass, but they're very good safety goggles. Now, Bob being this space engineer allows two things to be the case. First of all, I just shoved that straight for his eye. I don't even know how I managed that. And then the second one is, well, the other eye is the same. So, I'm, oh crap, I shoved it through that eye too. Give me the, give me the, give me the instrument, damn it. Okay, that's going to cause a problem. Uh, that's causing a problem. Okay, um, I think it's left his head, which is good to hear. Oh. Just cut that eye out. Happy days. And then we cut this eye out as well. With, by the way, the bluntest scissors I could find. Because, yet again, you did cost me my career in a surgery, Bob, remember? So, I have permanently blinded you. Which I thought, myself, was kind of funny. Now, last time, the nurses saw that I'd put some funny eyes in there, and they gave you real ones. So this time, I'm going to give you some real-looking eyes that are completely fake, and also make you look constantly high. So that every time you go, go into customs, you get stopped by them. I'm very sure the nurses will be fine. Yet again, what is with the balloons? Is somebody watching this? Anyway, Bob. Now you have two new eyes and can't see. This is perfect. Because now nobody would suspect you can't see. Because you have actual eyes. Pretending to be eyes anyway. In there. 